everyone, Hobby Sai here. Today I want to give you guys my review of the GHL Pro Flux 4 and how it's changed the way I interact with my reef. So stay tuned. I've had the Pro Flux for about three months now. The first thing I'll say about the controller in general is that you don't know what you're missing out on until you have it. Don't get me wrong, you can be a very successful uh, reefer without it, but if you've already gone past the beginner levels of reefing and you're looking uh, for more gear, adding a controller uh, could change everything and elevate your commitment to your tank to the next level. To me, the Proflux is more than just a controller. I like to think of it as my own personal reefing assistant. And when paired with the right add-ons, it's an assistant that can run tests for you, alert you if anything is wrong, uh, keep you organized, while at the same time perform reactive tasks as soon as they are required. With GHL's programmable logic, the possibilities are endless. The Proflux features many different types of ways you can connect to it, you can connect to it through Wi-Fi, set it up as an access point through the cloud, or connect to it uh, with a USB cable. Also, you don't need a PC to set it up because it can be done through the GHL Connect app on your phone. Um, the controller's multiple connectivity options come in handy because if you ever have an internet outage, you will always have a way to connect to it, either through USB or the hotspot. I personally use the cloud connection 95% of the time, which lets me access the controller from anywhere in the world, uh, where I have internet or cellular connection. To me, this has been extremely valuable as I travel frequently and having the peace of mind that my tank is doing well is everything. If you're looking for a how to connect tutorial, check out my other video in the description below. One of the main features of the Proflux 4 is that it comes with four probes temperature, pH, ORP, and conductivity. Although measuring these parameters by hand is relatively easy with other devices or test kits, the Proflux will measure all these parameters 24 seven, graph the values and can even act on them to turn things on and off like heaters, chillers, and with some more experience can even be used to regulate pH. It's difficult to express how useful having these live probes are, but I can assure you that they make a world of a difference. Uh, and overall give you a much better insight on how your tank behaves. To me, seeing the pH fluctuations throughout the day made me understand more about how my tank operates and as a result made me pull the trigger on installing a recirculating uh, scrubber for pH control, which has improved my overall coral growth. If you're interested in how I did that, check out my video on recirculating scrimmers after this video. I'll go ahead and link the description uh, down below. Um, GHL also offers a variety of other add-ons that can be paired with the Proflux to measure things like alkalinity, oxygen, CO2, and uh, soon to be calcium, magnesium, and nitrate as well in the form of the ion director. Uh, personally, I can't wait to get my hands on one of those uh, as it would essentially eliminate every manual test that I would have to do with the exception of phosphate. So GHL, if you're listening, go ahead and send me one of those, please. Um, the Proflux also lets you set up custom notifications that can alert you of any changes in your tank uh, that you may want to be aware of. Paired with the cloud access, such, as, uh, such warnings can be a lifesaver to your fish and corals in case anything goes wrong. Uh, I personally have the Proflux set up to give me warnings if any of those probes are reading values outside of my desired range. Uh, in a way, the best part of this feature is when you're not getting notifications because then you know everything is working fine. Knowing that I will get a notification if anything does go wrong gives me the peace of mind I need when I'm away from home. The last thing you want to do is rely on your significant other to tell you that all your SPS are looking kind of whitish. True story. Just kidding. I wish I was kidding. The Proflux also offers a series of add-ons like power bars and dosing pumps. These power bars are super heavy duty and not made with your typical cheap switches. They come with power monitoring, status LED indicators, and interactive controls 
when paired with the controller. The GHL dosers are super accurate with stepper motors that can dose to a 0.1 milliliter accuracy. They have automatic graphs, stirs, and both advanced and simplified scheduling. I honestly can't say enough good things. I've had these dosers since day one and they have been a lifesaver. If I was stranded on a desert island and could only bring one thing, it would be the GHL doser. Even if you're not running the Proflux, these dosers can be purchased as standalone units. For me, they get five out of five stars. Um, when the power bars and, and dosing pumps are paired with the Proflux, you get endless control possibilities, which will make running your reef tank so much smoother. Lastly, uh, my GHL is GHL's cloud-based platform that gives you the access to the controller from anywhere in the world. It's the same look and feel as what's available on the app, so there's no need to learn a different user interface. It has a super cool feature which allows users to share their settings with other cloud members and lets you grant remote access to a friend. This is really handy because if you ever need help setting something up, you can grant access to your friend uh, and they can take a look at your settings. The cloud also features the logbook, which makes keeping track of testing data easy and lets you catch trends whenever something changes in your tank. I used to keep this data in the notes of my phone, which was less than ideal. As much as I love the Proflux, there's still some room for improvement. Currently, calibrating the probes can only be done with the touch keys on the controller, and firmware updates require a PC. Also, because the Proflux has so many expansion options and features, it can get overwhelming. But with the right information, it's well worth it. After using the Proflux uh, the last three months, I will never set up another reef tank uh, again without it. The amount of features is nearly endless, and it made my overall experience in reefing so much more enjoyable. Uh, I strongly recommend this to anyone who is looking to elevate their reefing experience. Um, I will personally be looking to add a KH director as well as their upcoming ION director in order to take my uh, reef tank automation to the next level. I hope this video was useful to you guys. Don't forget uh, to like and subscribe and let me know in the comments below if you end up getting a Proflux uh, of your own. See you next time.